Thanks, Peter. A building in Hibbing is in ruins today after a fire late last night. Just after 9 p.m., Iron Range Fire Departments responded to a call of a large structure fire. Despite crews working all night, the building was ultimately destroyed. Northern News Now's car cop went to Hibbing today, where in the aftermath of the fire, the community is left in shock. Several Iron Range Fire Departments battled a fire overnight that left a family business in ruins. A little after 9 p.m. last night, we got a report of a possible structure fire at the Loader, uh, Yoder Lumber Company. Yoder Building Supplies is a contracting business in Hibbing. The Yoder Building housed many combustible items. Taking three aerial units, along with evacuation equipment, were deployed. It wasn't until nine hours later, the fire was extinguished. Due to the nature of the fire, the size of the building, and the involvement already of the heavy fire load, um, it was determined to be a, a defensive fire from the get-go. Hibbing Fire Chief Eric Jankala estimates about $1.5 million in damages. If you can see in the background, the size of the building is quite immense. Um, it didn't take very long for it to be a fully engulfed building. Yoder Building Supplies has been in the Iron Range for the last 25 years. The loss of this building came as a shock to the community. We are shocked. This community does not deserve this. It's yep. shocking. For Megan Hawkinson, who lives a few blocks away from the fire, said she knew the fire was large. The amount of destruction, however, was not something she expected. I just live a few blocks away and I could hear all the sirens going on for hours, so I, I knew something was going on. But then this morning, coming around the corner, there is no way to not come around the corner and just have your jaw drop. While the community waits to hear from the Hibbing, and Minnesota fire marshals about what caused the fire, they say they hope to see the family business continue in the future. I really hope that they're able to rebuild. Um, Hibbing seems like they've been hit by a few fires in the last few years, and we just so hope that they continue with their business here. In Hibbing, Cara Cop, Northern News Now. Fire department officials say there are no reported injuries. The origin of the fire will not be announced until the investigation ends.